The Great Inventor Series, The Balloon. Uh, science uh, salutes uh, uh, Willie Pinkham, just a junior assistant in a rubber glove factory who was convinced that something more important could be done with an empty rubber glove than put somebody's hand in it. He explored the amazing ability of rubber gloves to stretch and stretch and stretch. He tried filling an empty rubber glove with sand. He tried filling it with old buttons. Everyone in the factory was laughing at his rubber sandbags and his rubber button bags. And yet he knew he was on to something. He returned to his laboratory under the staircase in the boiler room to try one more experiment. He knew that sand was too heavy to be much fun and buttons were too bumpy. He needed to put something in the rubber glove that would be very light, as light as air itself. What could he do? Actually, it was his little sister Peggy who made a suggestion. Why don't you put air in it? And he did. It wasn't long before the very people who had laughed at his experiments were blowing up rubber gloves themselves. This, of course, led to the modern balloon as we know it today. 